This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. What's going on, everyone? This is Jacob Shoup. You are watching the 4 p.m. stock market update right here on TFNN on YouTube. Yeah, nice. Right on. Composites uh, off about 0.26%. We listen. We just had kind of a we had a little bit of a sideways day, right? Sideways to downward. We've had massive movement to the upside. This is to be expected. Yeah, the Dow Jones Industrial finishing up 0.11% at 43,958. Yeah, that DXY, that dollar out there, up about 0.96% at 106.49. You have crude oil off about 0.15% at 6802. Uh, the E-mini kind of sideways right now, up about 0.05% at 6,016. The gold contract, man, we are continuing uh, to plummet quite a bit in gold. Uh, off about 1% right now, trading at 2,580. So we cracked 2,600 and are still moving downwards here. Uh, you have copper off about 1.63% at $4. You have the Russell off about 0.91% at 2,383. Silver itself off about 1% at 3042. Did Tesla recover today? This was cool. Oh, it didn't do anything. Yeah, see, we're just getting a stall out here, kind of. Um, let's take a look. Well, first, let me just say again, check this out. I'm going to be talking about it tomorrow. We're going to be in uh, the Discord all day talking about it. If you guys need help with anything like that, you just email jacob at tfnn.com. You can also call my uh, work line, which if you need that, just email me. I'm not going to put it online. Uh, but seriously, check this out. Opening call newsletter by Basil Chapman. We have that subscriber webinar tomorrow at Sectors and Stocks for the next market phase. That's going to be 4 to 5.30 p.m. Eastern time. If you want to see a little more, more about what he's about, I did have him on the segment uh, last show. Uh, you can check that out on Tiger Financial News Network on YouTube. And then additionally, he's on at 10 a.m. Eastern time uh, as well. So check that out. Uh, Hims, Woo. Hims is moving again today. This is, this is getting to meme level, right? We're just... Reality is just <laughs> divorced from the price movement in it. Up 3.41% at 2760. In all respects here, I, I think what they've done is kind of interesting, right? So you, you're removing this GLP-1 drugs off of the FDA shortage list. Hims is developing their own locator. So if you live in an area, you need GLP-1s, you could use Hims, and it'll tell you if you're in a shortage, they get a compound. This is them trying to really combat the FDA though, which is kind of interesting. And uh, I love seeing that from, from CEOs. That's, that's tenacious, right? Folks, thank you so much for joining me. We'll see you tomorrow morning, 9 a.m. for Tommy O'Brien Show. Morning, market kickoff. Take care.